it to a local auction I bid online and um, then go pick up the stuff. So they had an auction with, I'm driving like an hour and a half away to go to this auction and pick this stuff up, but they had an auction with um, a whole bunch of Hot Wheels. I probably bought two to three thousand Hot Wheels for around two grand. Um, it was probably a little bit less than that because I did buy some other stuff and the total came out to two grand. And there was also an 11% virus premium on them, on everything. So I ended up paying like $180, $190 in uh, virus premium altogether. And I actually won stuff from two different online auctions, but one of them I only won like $30 worth of stuff, and then the other one it was like $2,000 worth of stuff. But they're right next to each other, so I just thought I might as well bid on both of these and uh, drive and go pick both of them up. So that's what I'm doing right now. Um, I just want to tell you guys to expand your sourcing habits. So if you're in a rut, if you're not finding anything at your thrift store or at garage sales, just uh, go out and see, go to some websites, go out and see what else you can find. So I've been going and looking at online auctions. I haven't found a whole lot at garage sales. I've found a decent amount, but um, nothing amazing at garage sales. And uh, I haven't been to a thrift store in a long time because my local Goodwills, they um, sell everything online, they scan all their books, and they list a, lot, a whole bunch of stuff online, so it just seems like nothing is there anymore, so I don't really go to those, I don't really go to thrift stores anymore, so um, I've just been looking at online auctions a whole lot, and this is one that caught my eye, and I decided to bid on it, and that's what happened. I end up winning a whole, whole bunch of stuff. And that's about it. If you like this video, make sure you like it, and I'll see everyone next time.